Well, we're back to another episode of the FIFA 10 Retro Cumulus. It is episode 8. And if you look at the date just below the, the, the star rating of the manager reputation, it is actually my birthday. For all the pedos out there, that is my birthday. Not um, not like I was born in 2009, but I would be 9 on this date. So there you go, just a wee bit of trivia, but as you can see, you look at the league table, things are looking fantastic, um, we're top of the league by a point from Dundee United, Celtic, Aberdeen and Hearts all joined 15, it's pretty close, you know what I mean, Every, I mean, everyone's on double digits, I mean look, from 6th up to, from 1st down to 6th, I mean it's 3 points, and from 1st down to ninth, it's 7, and then uh, Falcon and Hamilton are uh, not, not doing too good. And then there's just St. Johnston who are absolute pish and fucking doing e -haw. We spent no money in the summer and we're still top of the league. It was a, it was a pish start, admittedly. But now we're back and the next game is against Motherwell and Dundee United, Hearts, Celtic, Aberdeen. So a lot of tough games coming up in the next couple of episodes. But let's go and smash Gogsy. The Math Addicts fucking team. Here we go, man. We're at Fur Park. Week 11, as you see. We've only lost the one game of through two. Goal difference at seven. Didn't really fucking... Uh, let me see. I'm actually glad. Martin, Tyler, and Andy. Martin, Tyler's pissed, but Andy Gray. Someone different than that born prick. Alan Smith. And there is... The um, Ross Forbes, he plays for Morton now. Forbes, Forbes, always believe in your soul. Chris Morton is the man. No one ripped the piss out of him. Definitely not. But here we go. Let's keep the momentum going and get the job done. Boyd, great bit of skill. Nacho Novo, a wee bit over hit. Back post. Seriously, like, I mean, I, I was expecting... Not to be a good chance, not pish. Look at that pace from Boyd. And he can't fucking play him through. Like, if he plays that ball, we are away. Pedro Mendes. Poached. Lashley, ball goes out, and that is just. It's a throw in. And mother well have done hee haw this game, but neither of that. And fuck me, we can't be. Holy shit. Clear it. Clear it. Referees blew the whistle. Pedro Mendes. There wasn't a... There wasn't a fucking... Good force of a good save at McGregor. But, I mean, I'm telling you, it wasn't a... It wasn't a free kick, as you see, though. Lifts it over the wall. And he could have even caught that. I he's saying good save. But at least it didn't go in. That's all that matters. Jennings whips it in. It's a pish fucking ball. Miller finds Boyd, who runs, who runs, who runs. Chris Boyd will run all day. The only man, Airy Rera, in this team. No one can catch him. Chris Boyd blooters it over the bar, and that is shit. And that is the halftime whistle. It's nil-nil. It's been pretty disappointing. None of us, me or not Motherwell, have actually done anything of note. <laughs> so... The highlights were probably not much, but yeah, can we hopefully somehow get a goal in the second half? Let's hope so. Great play. Fuck me. You just, seeing you're running with someone in this, it's diagonal lines. You can't run any other fuck. You lose, just, your players just have no fucking agility whatsoever. I mean, look at this. Novo. What's he doing? Fucking overhead cross. Pathetic. Smith. Thompson, Rotham. Maybe the cross. That's good Corner. Cleared again. Win that. Fuck off, man. What a shite game to even fucking witness, let alone playing. Holy shit. No wonder they're celebrating. It's a lot better result for them than it is for us. But that was that was literally their only chance. That, that free kick. Go there, the other assaults, Kilmarnock drew, Hamilton, Dundee United drew, Aberdeen drew with Falker, Hearts beat St. Mert, and Celtic absolutely dis dem demolished St. Johnson, 6-1, or S. Johnson as uh, FIFA 10 puts it. As you see, a wee quick look at the league table, we're joint on points with 
Hearts and Celtic, but Celtic have went above us. Must be due to goal difference, and we need to beat Dundee United. So, this one's at home. Let's get the job done and win. We're at Ibrox here. We should see the job out. But you never know in this game. <laughs> this game's just a wee dodgy one, but here we go. Swanson whips it in and Francisco, Francisco almost challenges McGregor. Great play. Chris Boyd. Oh my god. Seriously. Come on, Thompson. Whip down. Rothen, can you win that? No, you're fucking, you couldn't be further from it, mate. And absolutely ripped apart at the back. Mendez now running forward. Can't. Ah, fuck off, I wasn't even nowhere near him. And I've put the controller down. Gomez. And he runs it right into his hands. Pathetic. Boyd, I tried to go out left, and it somehow played this wee fast, and the refs called it back. For God knows what. He's, he's, he's gave Mendez a yellow, which I'm assuming was, yes, was this challenge, which, fuck me, that could have been a red, so we'll, uh, we'll take it. Boyd. Fuck shit, can you not play a fucking better ball to him? What's the point of hitting why if he's going to do that? Come on. Polak, I mean, I, I did that about eight two. times. I mean, God, fuck it. The exact same with he, he just did to me, but fuck it. He'll get that and we won't. Swanson now running down the right. Whips it in. in cleared. De Miller. De Novo. De Bok. Fuck to off. Nowhere near Boyd. Fucking shit. That's what it is. And another free kick in a dangerous position because this team can't tackle. Gomez stepping over it. Gomez, Gomez, who gives a fuck? If it goes in, I couldn't care. Ah, oh, I didn't mean that if it went in. I meant it doesn't matter because whatever his name is, it goes in. For beat, 1-0, free kick. He does what Motherwell couldn't do last game, and that is score a free kick. And then Dundee United lead. Swips it across the Conway. And that should be 2 0. Count ourselves lucky. Mendez actually puts his body on the line to give him the ball away. Right, come on, McGregor. Up to him. Boy. That is the half time whistle. And I just don't see me even getting a goal here. So if you want to tune it to the Fed, I wouldn't blame you. Because we're not we're not getting anything here. I'm pish. And we just need to fucking come to the grips with that. I've just not performed this episode. I mean, look at that. One shot on fucking pish. Come on. Novo. Crossing in this game is just fucking irrelevant and pointless and pish. Every word that's shit. And it's time for us to make more subs because. Right. Who, who, who's dead? Richard Mc McRV's done in. Rotham is absolutely done in, so we're going to bring on. Oh, Boyd! No fucking way, man! Seriously? We're on centre back to join attack, so there should. I mean, why are these two back here? You should be fucking forward for us. That's an offside, even I get to that. No way, is it not? Come on, Boyd! Chris Boyd is stuck it in! Fucking great finish! I don't know how it wasn't off, but I don't. I don't care. I, d I don't know how Edu was not off because he, he looked fucking miles off, literally miles. Great finish, though. I thought it was skied, but that's a good mean. Even if the keeper was in that, that could have won in. But I want the win here. So draws great and all, but I want the win. Garon, come on, Novo. Come on! Yes! I, I mean, I think is the offside in this broke because I could have swore. I'm pretty sure it was Boyd who played it into initially, then he squirted the Edu. I could have swore. 
it was off, but who could, I mean, why take a touch, I mean, yes, seeing that kind of air, you need to hit it first time, I do, like, because it's fuck me, the amount of bodies that swarmed them. But we're leading 2-1, well, and, and, and hopefully that should be it, that, that should be the job done. Do the and the scoreline is 2-1. trying hard to get the ball up. It's finished now. And that is the full-time whistle. It's ended at 2-1 at Ibrox. Thank God again. for that. 1-0 down well, in the 85th minute, and we've brought, brought it back. There was our goal. Well, thanks for for the opener, oh, free kick, company. good finish. Until the next time, a very good too bad, you said they won the game, did you? It's Chris Boyd do a goal and an assist, very good. Very good for Chris Boyd, let's see what the other results were before we end this crock of shite. Did Celtic drop points? Probably not. No they did, they drew two each with Kilmarnock. But Hearts won, so recent results have not strengthened your position with the board, alright, that's no big deal. Yeah, even though, like, I mean, everything's just went up. But we play Hearts next, and if you look at the league, next episode is crucial. So we're joint top with Hearts, we play them next. It's a six-pointer, and then after that's the old firm in the same episode. So, both title challengers, even though there could be other teams that could challenge, but you never know. But anyway, that'll do it for episode eight. Leave your thoughts down below. Next time, it's the old firm and Hearts. It's going to be some epic shit, brother.